Okay, so this is question number two, and here we are asked to use our knowledge of social influence to explain what is likely to happen in the experiment. Okay, so if we go back and we have a look at the experiment, we can see that it's actually a conformity experiment. And they're basically looking to see if participants are going to go along with the group and complete the embarrassing questionnaire or not. So using our knowledge of ASH, we can guess that in condition one, they're going to go along with it because of normative social influence. And in condition two, they're not going to go along with it because they have social support. OK, and that is effectively what we are going to write. OK, so if I go back to question number two, and this is my answer. OK, so we're going to identify that more participants are going to complete the questionnaire in condition one than in condition two. And the reason for that is because they're going to want to fit in with the group and avoid rejection, which is normative social influence. And then on top of that, we're also just going to point out that participants in condition two have got social support. And so they're more likely to be able to defy the researcher and act independently. OK, and. That is your three marks for question number two. I hope that makes sense. I will see you in question number three.